Looks egg. Up, oh, stream over. Up, oh, I'm not. Hit the right button. Oh, I'm still waking up. Hi, everyone. It's me, Zerataro. I had a nap nap, and now I feel great, but I'm still waking up. Uh, I would like to thank the new followers. Uh, uh, Horizon, Dragon Cutie, Koryojo, and Reki320. Uh, we are that much closer now to our 100 follower goal, of which we will play Get Over It, which should be a good time, hopefully. We'll see. <laughs> when last we left our heroes, my controller died, and I was very embarrassed by it. Uh, so the controller now has a full charge. It was charging while I was sleeping. So, we should be good going forward. Um, everyone is mostly healed up. Was there... Anything in the cave I missed? I just want to take a quick look real fast. Make sure it wasn't like an item I forgot. I don't even know what would be here, but... Lindsay, good morning. Guess the controller lives, and so do I! Okay, yeah, this was... Oh, no, there's just like... Oh, wait, no, there it goes. It was a very important nap that we both had, me and the controller. Okay, no, there are no other items in here. Okay. I want to make sure I wasn't, like, leaving anything behind. But no, it's good to always make sure your controllers live, because controllers are a commodity that are running rare, especially PS3 controllers. I'm playing on a PlayStation TV right now, so I'm not sure how I would be able to install, like, drivers on that to, uh, be able to, like, run any other controller. <laughs> Bart, you are successful. The wind's settling back to how it used to be. As it should. And about my daughter. Doesn't seem like she went into the valley. After self regained her senses, she mentioned that nobody has gone to the place for months. I see. Where in the world could she be? Where are you, Arch? Please don't lose hope. We'll ask about your daughter as we travel. I'm sure she'll turn up. Well, thank you. Let's do it, Sylph said, and get to that Forest of Spirits place. It's south of Belladam. Ah, crap, where was Belladam again? Let's look at the map item. Alright, Belladam. Wait, was that like the first place I went to? No, wait. Euclid is there. Haramul is there. Uh, shit. Okay, uh... Uh, oh, okay, I see. I am the little red uh, plus on it. Okay, so Belladam is super, super duper, de duper to the south. Okay. De duper. I can map. I can map like the best of them. You think a little ham ham like me doesn't know the big old world? You'd be right, but still, I can map. Alright, Clarth, you got magic now. You gonna do anything? No? Oh, Jesus. Okay, wow. You're, you're strong now, Clarth. Hey, Toaster! Good afternoon. I hope you are doing well. I am all rested up and charged and ready for a very... Super awesome story expanding Tales of stream. We are going to do so many things in the stream. I don't even know where to begin. I assume we'll just make progress. So much progress, it'll blow your mind. What I would like for us to get is a another party member. 
Because there's nothing better in an RPG than having like a full party. It doesn't even look like it takes up that much of his MP. I say that, but I wasn't actually really keeping control of, or keeping an eye on his MP. Oh, I say MP, it's, it's TP. It's TP. Between MP and TP and PP is, I can't keep up with all the P. Don't forget SP. SP is important as well. So I was playing uh, uh, SMT5 uh, a few nights ago. I got to another boss I got a little stuck at. So right now I'm just kind of like leveling up and trying to like use better demons. But I remember around the PS2 and I want to say I believe it was in the Personas. Uh, like Persona 3, maybe 4. Uh, physical techniques used your HP to be activated instead of your M MP or SP. And they don't they don't do the new one. The new one they, they use MP same as everything else. But I vaguely remember that there was a technique I used, I think it was a digital devil saga where Yeah, okay, so it wasn't just me. Alright, so yeah, it was in some of those older games. But there was a, a technique where if you, like, absorbed all of the MP from an enemy, like, it would kill them. So MP was also HP. I'm not 100% sure, but I, f I feel like I remember that. Where, like, you couldn't run out of either. Because it would kill your character. Or maybe, like, the spell's, like, drawback was that if, like, all the MP reached zero, it would kill you. I don't know. It just... It just like was reminding me of it while I was like playing it and I was doing like these like physical skills because in uh, Persona 5 I made, or not Persona 5, SMT5 I made my character a uh, physical build. Because I thought if I could, you know, give them like Pierce Encounter, then I could just, you know, focus on like getting like all like the good magic elements uh, in the demons. And I felt like that was like a very, pretty decently smart strategy. But I'm just remembering like all the different like methods of like design like SMT has gone through throughout the years. I'd like to find where Bedlin is so I can get some new HP. Get my HP and MP revived before I go into this forest. Because although the cave or the mines didn't have a boss, I imagine this forest will have a boss. There we go. There is a town. Claire! Hello! I like how you have Sword Rain Alpha, one of my favorite moves. <laughs> uh, what is it called in this one? Oh, no, yeah, Sword Rain Alpha. No, yeah, it's actually, like, the strongest of the moves I have so far. Um, I need to master Demon Fang and Swallow Dance so I can have Demonic Swallow Kick. Uh, right now, they're both in the 80%. But, uh, but no, Sword Rain Alpha is, like, the strongest move that I have, for sure. How should I kill time today? It's an old monster appearing. What a pain. Where is the place I can sleep? Where is the villager, the old man's house? Can I still use your bed? Oh man, I'm crashing. Yes. Perfect. Nothing like a free room and stay.
seeing this game played, I see how Tales of Legendia followed the series and didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> Ooh, wait, I can press select. <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><
Ooh, do healing. Did it work? My cleric orders aren't strong enough. If only they were as powerful as my mother's. I don't know if even those would be enough for something like this. Damn it, this is bad. If mana disappears, magic will be out of everyone's reach. Perhaps we could defeat Deos before he travels into the future? One thing's for certain. We have to eliminate whatever's sucking up all the world's mana. The way things are going, history is bound to repeat itself. Literally! Right, but we don't have a single lead. So where should we start? If man is indeed related to magic, Deus might well be the one behind it. So if we take him out, there's a good chance that'll take care of things, yeah. But no doubt that's easier said than done. Of the spirits whose existence has been confirmed, the most powerful is thought to be Luna, the spirit of the moon. Moon! My research indicates that the ring necessary for Luna's pact can be found in Moria Mine. I've never heard of that place. It's an old dwarven mine controlled by Alvanista. It's about all I know. Speaking of Alvanista, that country is second to none in the world when it comes to magic research. I think going there for information would be in our best interest for now. So let's head to Veneniza, port town in the far north. Moon time! Oh, I hope we find cats there with a little cat computer. Very fast with that summoning skill. I rolled a one. What does it mean I rolled a one? A Koopo computer? Ooh! Yeah, no, if not rabbits, then like the naming ways. The the little moon moogles, the ones with the rabbit ears. I will take those as well. Either way, I want to see creatures on the moon with a computer hitting it with hitting it with their little like beep boop paws. All right, while we're here, let's buy some damn potions because we almost ran out last time. Buy apple gels, yes. Oh, is that all I can hold? Okay. Crap. Melange. Uh, life bottle, flare bottle. I'll keep that for a boss fight. The core. Oh shit, speeds of battle movement? Yeah. Let's equip that shit. A ring that enables the manual battle control option. What? Sounds very important. Can I... If I take that off, do I not have control of myself anymore? Or do I have to equip that on, like, the uh, teammates that I want to be able to manually control? I guess we'll find out in the next battle. 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 <laughs> Hello, bad. I'm taking you with me. all good to go. We're all itemed up. I'm gonna step out a moment and give it a shot. So that part doesn't sound any louder than it was before, unfortunately. So I guess I can't turn up the voice on those. Poop. Yeah. 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 
Okay, no, yeah, he definitely feels faster. And I still have control over him, so... That sounded a little louder. Okay. Here, here we go. All right. All right, we'll just take the shortcut this way. This is where we got the items that are on the north part. What? No, I had him. <laughs> Go mages! Oh shit, you're still alive. You're a tough old bird, quite literally. Alright, let's see. Alright, there's nothing for us in that town. So let's run with those little chibi feet. SNES chibi feet. <laughs> yeah, Pico Pico Hammer. Perfect. Now that's a good fight. Status of my arts. We're at 94% and 85%. Okay. The whole town's. Oh, wow. Shit. This town got wrecked. It was good just. God, we left for like five minutes. Hello? Any survivors? Can I raid the raid the stores? Oh, hello. Are you okay? Uh, I'm, I'm fine. What the hell happened to this town? Demeter. The mage, he did this. He, he killed Mama and Papa. Would you like some revenge? We're on a quest of revenge. Hell yeah! Crest gets it! Yeah, this is horrific. Unfortunately, we have higher priorities right now. Nah, there's no higher priority than revenge. That's true, but we just can't leave it like this. I don't want to big hurry, but vengeance! Come on, Clarth! What's gotten into you two all of a sudden? I think you're talking, taking this a little too personally. Yes, we are. We are taking this the most personally. No, that's not it. It's just I can't let this go. I'm not taking it personally. But personally, I feel like... <laughs> huh, great. Well, since both of you seem to have chronic hero syndrome, I guess I have no choice but to play along. So, young lady, can you tell us what you know about this Demeter? He's really a mage. The Zetor might actually be beneficial for us. I don't know where he is, but I saw him take the northern exit of town. Right, then we'll likely find them something in between here and Venezia. Just thank you all. Thank you all so much. I know it's a little late for introductions, but my name is Rhea Scarlet. This is Rhea will do. I meant. It's Chris and Clarth. Rhea sounds like a character name. Oh, she's a non-playable character. I was hoping she would have been like an archer or something. Well, no, we already had an archer. His name was Chester. <laughs> And he's dead. <laughs> oh well. Maybe we'll go back in time. Or forward. Maybe we'll go forward back in time before he's killed.
I guess we could always go back for it in time. And heal him. I don't know, it depends on how beat up he got. We never really saw for sure. We didn't see a body. It's a jackal! Oh, good job, Karth. Leveling up. I'm proud of you. Now that it seems like you're the type to actually learn any spells yourself. Since you're like a Pokemon catcher. We just gotta catch you some Pokemans. I love how the Pico Pico hammer is an attack. <laughs> The nice thing about having an archer is they're very good at hitting all the damn stuff that flies. Yay, we mastered Demon Fang. So now we gotta just master Swallow Dance and then we'll get ourselves a new technique. Booyah! What a huge port city. So many things to see, some people to meet. Maybe I'll run into a dark, tall, handsome stranger. Does this game have black people? Oh, I really hope it does. I don't want to be a racist game. Uh, hello, innkeeper. Bay Area Inn. There's only 48 gold? Hell yeah. That's only like one monster kill. I have to sweep and dust this place day and night. I work here as a living maid. Pays good, so I don't mind working so much. Damn, I wish I was a living maid. Kosuji-sama! I think that's how it said. Trading company. Do I have an appointment? I don't need an appointment. I'm a hero! Hi, people doing your jobs. What's the news on the manufacturing situation in Alvanista? And bring me pictures of Spider-Man! Hey, it's you guys. The guy I know was telling me about some crazy awesome research Midgard was doing in secrecy. Being a real bastard about it, too. Hyped it up like it was some huge scientific breakthrough, but wouldn't tell me what it was. All you need to do is liquor him up a bit more. What rotten luck. Because Midgard's pouring all the resources into a war, they've completely stopped exporting their goods. It sounds like a window for, like, a new service. I don't know what to tell you. Well, now that the Vice President's back, we should be able to write things out. Who's the Vice President? That'd be Elwin. Oh, yeah, we talked to him. Cool. We have a, we have a good for the, uh, good with the Vice President because we try to get him laid. Ooh, a protect ring. Let's give that to Mint. Because you gotta protect your healer. I bet if Aerith had a protect ring, she would have lasted a little bit longer. No guarantees. Hello, old couple that will probably die whenever things turn sour for this town as well. That's the grocer. What to buy? Well, we barely have any money, so probably not. Seth, I kind of passed out before watching Hamtar. Don't worry, I didn't watch any either. I also just fell asleep after last night's stream. It was a very good sleep, but it wasn't enough of a sleep, damn it. I had to sleep more. Oh, wow, this sounds is big. It's got two screens. Look at that. 
I guess this is technically a harbor. We're at the harbor. Hi. We'd like to go on a boat. Even freight shipping requests have dropped off. No. But we need to go. Uh, to Cinnabar Island. Excuse me, Captain. When is the ship leaving? Ah, uh, don't start up with that crap. We'd probably be well on our way to Alvanista right now if it weren't for Deus. I'm not about to put my ship at minute risk of an attack by him. Damn it, what am I gonna do? <laughs> hey, it's the crab from uh, DBZ Abridged. Let me teach you how to beat that Boomba Clat Freezer. <laughs> Nothing but free time lately. For a sailor, that's gotta be rough. I don't think they get paid for free time. Hey, bud. You sharing? Very good. Welcome. Price is 30 gold. Where would you like to go? Oh, crap. I didn't mean to hit that. Ah! At least you can speed him up. Oh, Jesus. Let me know when you want to go back. Now this was quite literally like you can only like uh, get to these places via the water. Well, luckily I've got like the best weapons still. Can I sell anything? I am kind of broke. Ooh, elixir sells for 5,000? Yeah, whatever. Rune bottle. What's rune bottle do? Put the contents over other items. We'll sell one. Um, what else? We didn't need that many of those. Sell that, sell that, sell that, sell that. Okay. Cool. What if you got stuck in a shop? Wouldn't that suck? <laughs> Let's go to the armor house. I guess the idea is that you'd always have at least like something you could sell. But it sounds like it wouldn't be impossible for you to get like soft lock there. Welcome to See Through. Ah, it's a harbor town and the armor is called See Through. That's cute. Ooh, we can't get better armor. And a better shield. Alright. Better armor. Alright. Uh, new cloak. New shield. No. Better our shield. Oven mitts. And gloves. There we go. Optimum. 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 Hey, there we go. I love optimization options in your game. That's just smart design. Let's go talk to the mayor. After all, we are heroes from the future. Clearly, he will want to talk to us. Oh, wow, this is a very busy place. Hello, little child. Are you the mayor? No. Hello, are you the mayor? A half-elf named Demeter. He wielded powerful magic, was extremely kind and charitable to the citizens of Demeter while studying his craft here in town. A year ago, however, he suddenly changed overnight. Castaway studies abandoned the town and settled on that distant western island he did. Oh, well, forget about swimming. Let's go ask around for right at the port, shall we? Let's be someone there we can convince by flashing a few coins in their face. Oh, well shit, well at least I found out about this Demeter guy. 
Good job, random person I talked to. Shit, yeah, no, the mayor's place is quite literally, like, waterlocked. We're currently celebrating a birthday party. Mmm, no. I don't like children's birthday parties. Let's go to South Town. It's only five clicks west of North Town. Right above East Town. Those people throughout the country of Euclid revere you Drizzle as a god. So they believe the spirit of Gaia, who they say protects the world, lives in the heart of it. And she's kind of a punk. <laughs> they certainly didn't hide the fact that this city is supposed to be Venice. Oh, Venezia! Why did I feel like I didn't get that? I'm a dummy. There goes all the culture in my little ham ham brain. <laughs> Increases escape speed. It's not a bad item either. Heavy boots. Okay, so your character can't be knocked over. Well, that's cool. Alright, we're at the dock. We're at the harbor. Hey, buddy. At the harbor. I like a good old refreshing sea breeze. How should I put it? It feels so romantic. Ah, Venezia. The city of love. Snarky, howdy howdy. Hope you are doing well today. We talked to a tree. And then we went to a town we went to earlier and it had exploded. So now we're chasing the guy that exploded it. And now we need a boat. But nobody wants to boat for us. So we're like, crap. Hello, bartender. Hello, bartender cat. I'd like to order a drink. What? You're out. Damn it. Hi, mouses. Ooh, bed. What? No heals? Well, I guess I already did heal. Thank God this game has a run button. Oh, the captain quarters. Let's steal his keys. No? Damn it. It's worth a shot. I'm on a boat! I guess let's go talk to our friend at the trading area. Maybe he can get us a boat. Nepotism, let's go! Hey buddy, remember how we tried to get you laid? Can you take us to this island where this powerful sorcerer is waiting for us? You are not the person we are looking for. Here we go. Oh, hey, it's you guys. Ah, oh, crap. What? Damn it. Who can I talk to? This is the break room. We look for the president's office. It's your immediate left outside the door. Hello, Mr. President. What are vagrants like you doing in my office? Can't just stroll around like you're in the place. Get out. I'm going to steal your paper. That's all I got. Okay.
Mm, nope, this isn't it. Maybe there was someone else I didn't finish talking to. That boat. Maybe the left boat. Alright. Can't talk to you, right? Nothing? Okay. Alright. Let's go back to the mayor's house. I probably missed something at the mayor's house. Because that's where we got our first big piece of info. Thanks, rower. Man, the rower's so fucking cool! Hello, child. To the mayor's older brother's kid's friend's big sister. I think my tongue's tied and not now. They're making small talk. I'm the mayor's older brother's kid's friend's big sister. So who's the birthday for? This house is huge. It's a huge bitch. You're the lady, right? Okay, that's who we talked to before. Okay. I'm the mayor of Venezia. This is a duty-free trade town with goods imported across the globe. Anything you could possibly want, you'll find here. But I'm curious, where are you all from? A small village in southern Euclid. Did that happen to be Belladam? If so, did you ever meet a man named Linios there? Not only did we meet him, he actually stayed at his house for a night. He's the village chief. Well, goodness gracious, village chiefs. So that's what he's been up to. Linios happens to be my younger twin brother, so this is pretty interesting to me. Hard to believe so much has happened since I moved ten years ago. Anyway, if you bump into Linios again, give him my regards. Ooh, long travel overseas. Supposedly, I can't go to Midgard because they're fighting a war. I can't go to Alvinista either. The captain of the ship that goes there is being a scaredy cat. Oh, damn it. We've talked to everyone in town. Hey, you. What a huge port city. So many things to see. You, old couple. Do y'all know information? What? Elves? What's the last thing I did? Uh... So there was someone at the mayor's house that said that we have to uh, get a boat and take it to an island to the west. Can I take this boat? No? Poop. Can I take this boat? Nope. Poop. Can I take this boat? Give me a boat! Alright. I'm gonna leave the town for a bit. There's clearly some flag I'm not triggering. Western Island, Western Island. Do I have to like walk over there? Well, that's the cave we need to get to. Okay. So we definitely need a boat. My shield looks different now! Time to level up, Swallow Dance. Oh, 
I used up about like a third of all my MP there. <laughs> there we go. Alright, we got him. What comes first, the chicken or the egg? Chicken came first. It just it just showed us right there. Alright. Let's get our let's get our TP back. Nancy, what are you doing here? I really wanted to see him in person, so I asked the traveler to escort me. How did things go with Elwyn? Did it work out? Well, sounds like there's something wrong. No, is there anything we can do to help you with? Surely nothing more. Surely there's nothing more important than a side trip right now. Help her, yes. Wait, no, we wanted to help her. We're gonna get that Yule in person late if it takes us this entire stream. It's just whenever I get to the entrance of the building he works in. Okay, found out. It says you gotta do the. Oh, okay. Well, hey, then we're there. Nice. <laughs> I'm such a nervous wreck that I can't even turn the knob on the door. Say no more. Leave it to us. Appreciate it, Snarky. I'm glad to know that my meddling and wanting to get this dude uh, hooked up was the proper choice of responsible RPG adultmanship. Oh, hey, it's you guys. Can I help you with something? I actually want to tell you that Nancy followed you all the way here. Oh, she did. Seriously, she desperately wants to meet you. Please at least see her just this once. All right, she wins. How about in front of the fountain in the center square? We made friends with this guy, Stalker, and we set up a meeting. We should probably watch from afar to make sure she doesn't give him a beating. Uh, is he really going to come? He said he'd be here shortly. Oh, hey, speak of the devil. Hello there. You're Nancy, if I'm not mistaken. That's me. I think we should leave them alone. All right. Use protection, you two. Bye. Captain. Damn it. Hi, can I steal your boat? Ah, damn it! Alright, let's go check on the lovebirds. Oh shit, they're gone. Oh, they're double gone. The birds were replaced by literal birds. Uh oh. Oh no. I will decide who your bride is. Now I decide you're not going to marry some bumpkin girl like that. Damn it, they're already engaged. We left y'all alone for five minutes. So, what's best for you? Do as I say. I'm not your slave. I'm your son. Wait, Nancy. A girl like that isn't for you. Get over yourself. Don't get cheeky with me. Yo, in. That foolish kid. Come on, man. If anything, can't he just have her as like a side girl? And then you have like a professional marriage on the side where they don't love each other and then the, the wife gets to sleep with whoever she wants? I mean, that sounds like a proper like olden day 
like political marriage, don't you think? What are vagrants like you doing in my office? Can you just roll around here and bring me pictures of Spider-Man? <laughs> are you back in the fountain? No. Oh, hey! What to do, what to do. Encourage him. Hep, yeah! What am I going to do with my dad? He's being such a flexible jerk about this. Why not leave behind? Just hop on a boat and go somewhere. Oh, yeah, we know this nice island to the north uh, northwest. Hop on a boat, go somewhere far away there, he'll never find you. Please, Clarth, you shouldn't tell someone to do something as irrational as that. I should have thought that crossed my mind as well, but still, you really shouldn't. It's probably the only way we'll be able to live happily, though. I'm sure it'll be tough at first, but the two of us have it. Y'all just met each other five minutes ago! Well, I think they'll get out of this mess just fine. Just fine. True love between a man and a woman knows no bounds. Take it from me. You kids will never understand what you kids will understand what it means sooner or later. Nancy, are you still here? No? Okay. Damn it. I just feel like the beginning of Frozen. Yeah. It just feels a little irresponsible, you know? Hello? Has anyone seen Yulin? Or his mistress? Hey, look, bro, I'm just trying to help you out. And by help you out, I mean help me out. I'll explore every corner of this town if I have to, till I find those two foolish kids. Did I check in here? No. Alright. Did I check the inn? Tons of cats. And a dog. Woof woof. Okay. Getting distracted. Huh. Where could they be? I checked all of the three places I know of. Oh, hey! Here's how you get to that other boat. I said we want passage somewhere. Oh, customers, forgive my insolence. Trying to find a ride to the Western Island. Can you give us a lift? Creepy Island, a meter supposed to move to? Well, then. 200? 800 for the, all of you? Yeah, it's fine. I have to say, the entrance to that boat being, like, all the way at the tippy-tippy top of the stage? Not good design. They should have just had the bridge be on the same side as the other port. But that's just me. Alright, so. Oh, well, wait. So, that cave I saw wasn't the cave we're going to. We're actually going to someone's house to kill them. Well, take care. If you ever feel tired, go ahead and sleep in the cabin. Well, then. We're gonna kill ourselves, a magic-wielding explosive guy. He blew up a town, and I kind of forgot to ask why. Mmm, melange. The gel must flow. Oh, such spooky music. do 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 This is it. Quite a place Demeter's got here. Now, why did he attack Harmel? To demonstrate his power, I think. The same reason he killed his master. He was his own master? Damn. This guy's got issues. Yes, my papa. And then, he got mama. 
That's sick, son of a... Well, I'm not nice enough to let a heartless bastard like that run free. Let's find him and kick him square in the nuts. Magic can't protect you from that. At least no spell I've ever heard of. <gasps> you don't suppose he's made a spell to protect his nads? Crap. We need to act fast. More chests! Nice, we made our money back. By robbing this guy completely. What else can we steal? Ooh, save point. I will definitely steal that. Because again, my foolishness, I hadn't saved in a while. Practically a whole hour. This is going to like, bite me in the butt here eventually, I'm sure. Hey, I think we found a meter study. Let's give it a good once over. Bet he's hiding something useful. Like a gun! Mana generation. Everyone who uses magic knows that mana is born from the of the world tree. However, in human society, knowledge of this fact is the exception, not the rule. Hell elves use magic. The elven village has no kindling. It is unnecessary. The elves use magic to make fire. The elven vi village has no ice house. Necessary that elves use magic magic to make ice. They have no shovels. They use magic to dig up the ground. The Elven Village has no fans. The Elves use magic to make wind. Alright. Ooh, savory. Okay. Now I want to read this fancy book that's been left open, possibly on the chapter we need to understand his weakness. An Elf's View of Life. In the beginning, only Elves were able to weave mana. It was a skill that should belong only to Elves. When those who diluted elven blood appeared, half-elves, as they came to be known, the world began its descent to chaos. Ugh, mm, I don't like where this is going. Magic is intended to be a tool used to sustain daily life. However, the half-elves began using not only for that, but to commit murder. Certainly, magic has the power to even make a star fall upon the world. However long ago, our elven ancestors sealed away many of the most powerful spells. I pray such spells will never be necessary in the world. I forget... No, Illusion of Gaia has the comet that's about to hit the earth, not this game. Memories of the Elven Village. The elves rise with the sun every morning. The men head in the woods to hunt, while women tend to vegetable gardening after domestic chores. By midday, all work is complete, and after lunch, people pass their afternoons with reading. The village becomes lively as the evening prepares, supper, sun sets, elves thank God. Sounds boring. A scrap of paper came out. Sorry you failed. Too bad. Dick move. Ow. That's fire. A tower shield? Damn it, I just bought a tower shield. Let's poop in his bed. I found about everything I could, but... But I didn't find the key I'm looking for. Oh, I get it. There we go. No? Do we have to wait for daytime or something? Yep, this is the manor. I have realized that there is a light puzzle in this room. I'm just not sure how to activate said light. Or lasers. Gargoyles, are y'all in charge of the lasers? No? Damn it. Oh, there's a chest here. 
This guy loves the savory. I swear. He's got it everywhere. Alright, I must have missed something in the study. Alright. Anything? 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 See, we read all the cabinets. What's in there? Can I push it? Found a key. I found it! Nap key! Hem hi! How are you doing today? I hope your afternoon is going well. I found the key! Oh, this tree's in the way. That's why the light's not working. I think the tree's alive. Oh, would you look at that? It is a tree monster! No! Let's kick their butt! Wispy Woods! It's time for you to go down! Yeah, Sword Rain Alpha! I love this spell. Since we're facing Wispy Woods, we have to have Angry Zerotaro, just as Angry Kirby would be the only one we could count on at this time. These trees are bitches. I was expecting a boss, not a bitch. Hey, cool, we mastered Swallow Dance, so now we should have uh, enough mastery to get that last spell. Yo, we got a good bit of money off of that. And a new art, cool. That'll actually work out. Alright, so now we have enough light for the laser puzzle. Alright, so first thing first, arts. No, not you. What about you? No, okay. Alright, let's replace Demon Fang with Demonic Swallow Kick! And then we'll pl replace Swallow Dance with, uh, Tiger Blade! To do his slash slicing up and then down. That sounds cool. Oh yeah, I already solved the puzzle. <laughs> Oops. Oh, a staircase opened up. Been a while since you last finished Fantasia, but good to see it again. This is my first time playing it. I'm actually very excited. I touched a little bit of the GBA version a few months ago. Uh, this is the PlayStation 1 version, so it runs a lot smoother. I am actually enjoying it a lot. Barkeep, I'll have your finest cat. Cat, I'll have your finest person. PS1 version definitely the way to go? Yes. I was looking around and I saw that there's a, a PSP version of the sequel. Uh, I think it's called like uh, Pasakiri like Neo Dungeon. But the only, but uh, there hasn't been a translation team that like uh, has like finished it yet. So I don't even think that the uh, Game Boy Color version has been translated, has it, for the sequel? Damn it. Save. There we go. Not carrying the dungeons? Okay, yeah. I didn't think they had either. It's crazy how many like weird sequels ended up on like the Game Boy Color. Like um uh, Star Ocean 2 has a Game Boy Color sequel. Uh Blue Sphere or Blue Burst or something like that. 
I may have gotten that confused with that fantasy star, but uh, but yeah, no, Star Ocean 2 has a Game Boy Color sequel, and it's like, what? And then Quest 64 has like a Game Boy Color upgrade <laughs> or something like that. It's like if they just waited a few more years, they could have put them on the Game Boy Advance. What is that, gel? A magic lens. I can't hold any more magic lenses. Okay, let's go downstairs now. Now that we saved. Lufia had a GBC sequel for whatever reason. Oh, it does! I actually own a copy of that! I found it in like my, my box of random Game Boy Color games. It's a... Uh, yeah, if I remember, it takes place in between 1 and 2. Luffy is also a game series I need to play. I have uh, the... Uh, well, yeah, I guess I have the SNES and the uh, Game Boy Color one. I don't have the GBA Luffy's though. But uh, I love old school PS1 RPGs. They're all so good. Well, I say they're all so good. I'm sure there are some bad ones. I know, between, like, PlayStation 1 and PS2, like, the, the renaissance of the RPG. Oh, crap! Tractor beam! No, my mage friends! Ah, y'all got dropped to y'all's heads. That was kind of silly. Yeah, but I've gotten a copy of Tales of Arise, but I figured before I actually play, like, the newest Tales, or Tales of game, it'd actually be fun to go back and try the oldest Tales of game. First Luffy is alright, but it's heavy early SNES Syndrome sequel is generally a great game. Play that one without having played the first one, too. Yeah, no, I hear it's, like, very much like a sequel, like, like, like you have to, like, know the story. But still, ever since I've kind of started, like, uh, like, streaming, not full-time, but I guess more often, like, I have been having fun, like, going back and actually completing a lot of the old games on my backlog, slash, sitting in my boxes. I'm glad there is still a market for old-school RPGs to be watched. Oh, clan class is starting today? Oh, Jesus. I thought you still had a few days before the semester started. Well, I hope class goes well. You hurry up and get that degree so you can become, like, a savior of the, of the planet. I believe in you. You've got this. Ah, Sword Rain Off is still so cool. <laughs> oh, you started yesterday. Oh, okay. Yesterday was a very busy day. I, it kind of flew by. Oh shit, what is this? Ah! It's an encounter, that's what that is. Oh crap, these raids are dangerous. Hurry, knock them down. Hurry! Distract them with deep mist, or the Pico Pico hammer. Hey, we did it. Alright, now what's this say? It is within the black, the flame, the shadow of darkness that there is glimmering light. I'm sure that is the answer to a puzzle. No, crap. There we go. We have to keep distracted. Keep distracting them! Their tractor beam hurts. Yeah!
speaking of, let's go ahead and use an apple gel on mint, just in case. All right, chest, armit. You're an armit, and a core. Hmm, words. Thrust is better at thrust. If it's better at thrust, then it's probably better for uh, uh, sword alpha. So we're going to switch to that for now. God, this is not a sword. This is a, this is a pike. <laughs> I am one-handing a spear. Clark, kind of just like overkilling everything. Go, 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 go. Left. Yeah. All right, I guess we'll go and just like switch places. I want a fourth member of my party so bad. I have a block button. Although I like how there is kind of like an auto block feature in this game. It is very handy. Onward! Into this big fancy door! Oh, that was cool. That was cool. Oh, good, a save. What should I do? Let's use some more gel. Some HP gel. Oh, what did I do with it? There we go. Okay, items. I'll take that, and he'll take that. Okay, we should be ready. Ready for whatever stands in our way. What a motley looking crew. Ooh, you look fancy and evil. You must be Demeter. Or Demeter. You're responsible for the murder of Rhea's parents, and we're here for vengeance. On guard. Oh, you're familiar with the Scarlets? What is this vengeance nonsense? I love my master. I would not wish him harm. The Scarlets died in an accident. Cut the crap. Where did you hear such lies, I wonder? The Scarlet's daughter herself, Rhea. What else could it be? Cer certainly, the Scarlets had a daughter. But you're saying this girl in front of me is her? Uh, ignorance is not bliss, I'm afraid. Allow me to enlighten you. The daughter of my beloved Master Rhea died in the very same accident that claimed both her parents. I do not, know, do not know who that girl truly is or what she is thinking, but you have come here chasing a lie. A blatant fabrication while this girl bears no resemblance to that of Rhea Scarlet. Lovely. How the hell can we know who's to tell him the truth? Rhea, please tell us that he's deceiving us. Allow me to make a proposition. If you leave that girl here, I'll forgive you for trespassing into my manor. Who do you believe? Oh, shit! Oh! Oh, no! Oh, crap! Ah! Uh. Wait, is this, does this have, like, the old Star Ocean thing that, like, you can, like, lose people in the party if you make the wrong decision? Uh. Crap. 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 Wait! Wait, okay, he's sounding really cool and stuff, but people are saying, like, in town that he was acting possessed. And that he, like, left. 
And didn't someone say that he killed his master? Or are those all rumors? I, we don't really know anything about this girl. And the town was pretty destroyed. Why would he go destroy a town and then come back here? It doesn't really sound like it makes that much sense. Ah, crap, ah, crap, ah, crap, ah, crap, ah, crap. Ah, crap. Girl's an NPC anyways. Mm. Maybe she's a ghost? Maybe she's a ghost and wanted vengeance? Okay, we did save, right? We saved before we did this. We will believe the girl who was left all alone inside the smoldering ruins of a town who just gave us her sob story. I want to believe her. I'm sure she has her reasons. Look at this reflection. You finally shown your horns, monster. You must be one of Deus's minions. What? You really see them, do you? You think you're sealing yourself since the beginning? Mwahaha! <laughs> Don't think you can escape alive! Prepare yourselves! Crap, he's got golems! Oh wow, the golems don't stand it. Uh, don't stand a chance against my new technique. Yeah, distracted. Good job, Mint. Ow. Alright, I'll help. We have to stop this guy. He is also a threat. Okay. Alright, now let's focus him down. I used up all my TP. Oh crap, I got stunned. Oh, that's cool, he has like a fire whip. We got him! Booyah! We got six, 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 six gold. Did we really do the right thing? Miss Scarlet. Are you alright, everyone? Th thank you so much. Hang in there. Now I can pass on to where my parents are as well. Huh? This is my final wish. Take good care of my kind-hearted friend. Your friend? Oh, she was possessed by the daughter. Oh, shit! I called it! I called it! There was a ghost! What just happened? There's something in her hand. It's a ribbon? Was she holding on to that the whole time? Ah! Where am I? Where's Rhea? What happened to Rhea? No, I'm... I'm Arch. Oh, we found Arch! We found the girl we were looking for. But Rhea was my best friend. Oh, that's sad. No, there were still chests in there. I didn't get the loot. I'm not angry. I'm just happy you made it home unarmed. I'm really sorry, Daddy. <laughs> Crass, give them a moment. So I guess Rhea had so much hatred for her killer that her grieving friend loaned her own body. 
She went to heaven, didn't she? Yeah, I'm sure. Soul channeling, huh? The arch girl's affinity for magic is probably what made it possible. Who knew it would turn out like this? Miss Rhea. Oh, I'm sorry, I mean Miss Arch. It's okay, I'm cool with that, but drop the Miss part, okay? You're a mint, right? Well, I guess I can't stay looking like this forever. What'd you think? Oh, that ponytail looks very pretty. And my clothes, poof! I appreciate you helping, Reyes. Now it's my turn to help you guys out. So disturbing to hear the same innocent face speak with such a different tone. Well, this is what I really sound like. Oh yeah, I got something for you. It's a thank you from my daddy. Ooh, we have some more packed rings. Oh, let's go get Ifrit and Shiva. Okay, that's about it. Now we finally go to Alvanista. Oh, cool. Alright, she, she did join our party. What do you have? Oh, yeah, we have to get the books identified. Oh, how do we identify books? Can we use, uh... Uh, what is it? What is it, the thing? The thing, the, the lens. Can we use the lens? Nope, we can't. Okay, those are only for battle. Okay, crap. Where do we get items identified? Also, what do you have? You have a broom. I called it, I called it, I'm not gonna let myself live it down cause I called it. <laughs> this is why you trust random people you meet in the ruins of towns instead of evil sorcerers. That fortune cookie didn't lie to me. This town is still super dead. Okay. Crap, there's still chests in that guy's place. I have to buy the boat to go back there again. Oh, that's cute. She flies. She's a little witch. She's a little Kiki's delivery service. Oh, wow. She just got fireballs. Shit, yeah. Yeah, let's get all the mages up in our party. Dang, that's cute. <laughs> Going back to Valencia. Gonna take us a boat back to a manor. See, I feel like that should be like an AoE. Where's Julie? I don't know. She needs a cat familiar, that is for sure. Maybe we'll get her one later. Let's see. Okay, go up. Go here. I went the wrong way already. Alright, let's try again. Go up. Go here. I was kind of hoping to see uh, Yulin and the girl. No? Hey, Chief, I brought you pictures of Spider-Man. No, you don't want to tell us about your son? Well, whatever. I don't want to care. I'm not going to ask then. All right. Um, oh, it was up this way. Hey, Captain. We want to go back to the island. I'm going to get those damn chests. 
and they're going to be totally worthless, and I'm going to feel like I wasted my time and money. Booyah! Maybe we can give the manor to the captain. Be like, hey, do you want this house? No one's living in it anymore. All you have to do is give us your boat. I mean, this doesn't look like a place that you need to like worry about paying like property taxes. Since, you know, it's all like haunted and cursed and shit. Well, sorry, y'all. Ah, uh, it only it only affected the people on the ground. Oh, well, she has a nice heal spell too. Damn, she's like a real mage. That new like technique, the demonic swallow kick, is actually pretty good. Like these like combo moves are actually worth like mastering for. Oh, up, uh, up. Uh, there we go. Yeah! Lightning blade! I don't think I've ever done the new technique I got. The tiger blade. We should do that next time. There we go. Okay, that's cool. Not the most useful right now, but... Yo, get wrecked! We're getting so much money. I'll take that. Cabbage. Okay. Oh, there was a chest on this side, too. Elven boots. Hmm. Don't know if the boots will help you fly any faster, but it would be cool if they did. These scrubs are easy sauce. Go, go, go. Yeah, we're, we're doing pretty good. We haven't really come across anything like super tough yet besides like those uh, golems early on. All right, chest one. What we got? We got a halberd! Hey! That sounds like it's worth coming back for. Thank you! Is it... Nipiki? Nipiki? Thank you so much for hopping in and chatting about the RPGs. You have a good night. And I, yes, I will definitely have a very good stream. Yep, this is way better. And what's here? And we got a new grimoire. Okay. We have to figure out where we can identify items. Oh! I thought Ice Needle was like, it, come, it comes up from the ground, but it comes up from the sky. Nice. And we probably saw all these room bottles too. We're gonna be rich. Rich, I say! Rich as French kings. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, 
Oop, he was already dead. Ah, oh, that attack is so strong. I wonder if I'll get anyone else as like good at like physical attacks, because so far I've only gotten like ranged people. Like even Chester was a uh, archer. Curious, very curious. Captain, gonna steal the bed real fast. Get a free heal out of this. Healing. Okay, now that we have this settled, we should be able to get ourselves over to the new continent. I did it wrong again. There we go. Okay. Go up, go up, go up. Go up. Hopefully none of those rats have the plague. Alright, Captain. Let's go on back. I'll take this time to hydrate. I want to know what's in that cave. All right, great talking to you, Captain. All right, now let's try the bigger boat. What are you gonna do, Arch? Hey there, hot stuff. Won't you pretty please do a favor for cute little Archie? If you do, I'll give you anything you want. That really isn't something I wanted to hear from a kid. <laughs> Captain will pay for whatever necessary to take a trip to Avanista. Fine, fine. <laughs> Arch has learned the title Femme Fatale Failure. One way fare, including shipping, is 170 gold per person, 680 for Ladia. Yeah, new continent time. Hopefully we don't get eaten by Leviathan. Most boats I take in games, I end up getting attacked by Leviathan. Oh, the sea breeze feels so lovely, doesn't it? So, which one's your type, Cress? <laughs> what? Manta Arch. Wait. There's something so vivacious about Arch, you know what I'm saying? Wait a minute now, I'm not thinking about them like that. Oh, really? Well, if it was my choice, I'd be all over. Clark, I can't believe you. You already have Merle, don't you? What? That's, that's dumb. That's dumb. She's nothing more than my assistant. What, does she assist with you again? Everything in the bedroom, Chris. Everything in the bedroom. Oh. Hey, you guys by chance adventurers? Something like that. It's a poor wandering swordsman. Mayor's the name. So you're a mercenary out on a job hunt? Now nah, I've got my set set on exploring the Moira Mine over in Avenista. It's the remains of an ancient dwarven ore mine. This is the first time you've heard of it? Anyway, the guards there won't let you so much look at the place without a permit from Avenista. Will you be able to get one? Shouldn't be a problem. My pals in the adventurers guild should make getting that painless. Getting kind of hungry. Then we'll go inside and get some grub. 
to trade stories. Deuces. Kind of think of it, my tongue is growling like a lion. Well, it's about dinner time. Grab a bite. Shouldn't we be worried with a, uh, about the permit? Hmm, looks like all the tables are taken. Hey, he's got enough seats for all of us. Even though he's just drinking ketchup. That was about a drink. Cheers to encounters! There are a couple places you could have went to get arch new spells. Ah, damn it! One hour later. Oh man, look, they're living it up. They just keep chugging and chugging. Two hours later. Damn it, they're still going strong. Arch, are you still with us? <laughs> Three hours later. <laughs> And then we finally found the elusive chest. It turned out the damn thing wasn't just empty. It, it didn't even have a bottom. <laughs> oh man, that's, that's priceless. They're so happy. I gotta say, I like you, brother. So I'll tell you. Yeah? yeah? It's between us, you know. What was that? Come on, you can tell your old pal, Clark. I'm not going to moor ya. S say what? I don't do that, Chris. No touching allowed. Uh, yeah, so I got this, you know, Contact Adventures Guild, and I got some info I can sell for. Fat sack of gold. My top secret stuff, you know. Hey, don't tease me, bros. It's gonna blow your mind, right? Alvanisha seems, you know, it's all good on the surface, right? The thing is, the thing is that. Dallas has been influencing stuff behind the scenes and places just about all under his thumb. What? How's that? L l listen, listen, my man, listen. The pr prince, what was, what was his name? Lord Laird? Yeah, it's the only heir, right? I just got some proof. He's being controlled by one of them monsters working for Deus. I mean, why well, do you think Alvanisa won't lift a finger against him, huh? Well, they're just powerful as Midgore, ain't that right? I'm telling you, it makes, it makes perfect sense, don't, don't you think? That's unbelievable. Hi. Come on. Dame, 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 dame. Hands off. Men, men, you can both marry me. Anyway, you keep that to yourself, eh, brother? I'm smashed. I'm gonna try to place the crash that ain't the floor. And then he just like falls out right out of the chair. Hey, time to go. Arch, you'll be sneezing for a week if you sleep with your face planted in a puddle of booze. <laughs> you can be such a naughty boy, Cress. Do I really want to know what the hell you're dreaming about? Come on, kid. Up you go. Arch has done the title, Three Sheets to the Wind. She's getting some good titles. Alright, look Arch, a real bed. Hi! Everyone feeling good? Everyone sobered up? Oh, good morning, Mayor. Can I help you? Uh, Chris, look out! Oh! Clarth, what'd you... Come on, Chris, outside. I think he's being controlled. Oh, shit! Clarth, are you okay? Oh, head's pounding. Hangover of my life! Alright, time to solo this stage.
Go, 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 go. I think I'm going the wrong way. Captain. Above all, let's do something about that berserker. He's your friend, right? Don't calm down. We'll be swinging with the fishes in no time. That ain't good. Alright, Mayor. Go, go, go. Hi. I need your finest hangover proof cat. Mayor, get a hold of yourself. Help me. Ah. Oh crap. Come on. He had he had blinks. He had iframes. Go 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 go. Ha! Gotcha, mid cleave. Oh, I got a sword. Very, very nice. Chris, are you alright? Like you said, Mayor's being controlled. And by a monster. I expected one of Deus's henchmen. Probably wanted to kill us after Mayor spilled the beans about Alvinista last night. How's he doing? Didn't make it? Poor guy. Oh no! Poor mayor. I have to be more cautious from here on out. Huh. Everyone pour one out for mayor. He was a good he was a good friend. Hopefully we can get his pass for the mine. <laughs> Thanks a lot for the ride. Even with all the trouble on the way, this does us a lot of good, Captain. How much with you guys on board is nothing at all. People have got to watch out for one another. Some and everyone in the world should have drilled into their heads. Well, we got no time to waste. Hurry to the castle. Things are going from bad to worse if we don't save the prince as soon as possible. Everything pretty hard about that. Rushing into a heavily guarded castle without a plan will be reckless. Let's head over to the inn and put one together. No, let's look for the items. Item place. We have to get items. Uh, uh, items, uh, identified. Y'all are some fancy looking sprites. This country is suffering from a food shortage. Oh, that sucks. I'm trying to convince the shippers here to bring some from back from Euclid. Is there any way I could possibly persuade you into selling all that rice you're carrying? Please, take it off your hands before you're gold. Yeah, sure, whatever. I should have bought more rice. Best not, get, best not go up against that evil crab. Many a good man has fallen victim to his nefarious devices. Dear Mr. Crab, please move out the way. We don't have time for this. Why are you doing this? What did we ever do to you? If only you were a little larger. I'll flip you on your back. That I find your weak point. And strike it for massive damage. I mean, just like the ninja battles, those ancient history books I read. Okay, this is adorable. I love this so much. You're not even listening to me, are you? Fine, then I'll just leave. See how you like that. Hey, Mr. Crab, please move out the way. Oh. <laughs> He's too strong. He's too strong an enemy for us right now, but we'll come back. I promise we'll come back. <laughs> Pub's a hot spot for Advent Adventure. <laughs> Advent Errors. Yeah, no, that's a, that's exactly how it goes. You silly ham ham. Most likely that's more or less the only place where they can get an entry permit. Come on, item shop. Item shop. Item shop. Hello. Oh, you're a pharmacist. Can I get... Mm, 
No, no. Well, we can buy some more of this at least. We have like 17,000 gold. Like, that's a lot. What about... Yep, it's locked. I'm out. Huh. What about... Grocer? Will you identify this sword for me? Welcome to the pig out. Huh, sure enough, they don't have any rice. A rice shortage must be pretty bad in a place where you have all that food. Nothing to cook it with! Oh, rice sounds good tonight. Where's the inn? Where's the weapon store? Oh, there's the armor. That's a start. Hello! An oven meant for you. Got one for you. Thought we had a ribbon for her. Straw hat for you. Jesus. Okay, well, there went all of our money. <laughs> Alright, equipment. Optimum. Oh, wait, no. Trust. Okay. Alright, let's sell. It says if you exit to the right and re enter, you can slip past the crab. Oh, okay. We'll try that when we get back. Alright, first let's sell all this. Make a little bit of our money back. Okay. And you are the weapon person. Ruby Wand. Alright, I guess just the wand for now. Alright, I need to find what's going on with these items I can't identify. Nope, that's not it. Alright, hold on. I want to see... Tales of Fantasia, how to ID items. Okay, so you have to use room bottle, so I thought I used a room bottle. Not new. Battle. It's consumable. Okay. Alright, item. Okay. Room bottle. Oh, okay. Naughty magazine! Yo! Lieber Omvis and the King in Yellow. And Flame and Faith. Fame and Faith. Okay. Yo, that was pretty cool. Are any of these things any good? good slash. Not as good as thrust. But it looks cool, so that's what's important. Now. Alright. Flimsy and unsuitable for combat. Damn it! We can't use the magazine. But that's right, we can use the Liber Evonis. And I guess we can just sell the rest. Uh-huh. Goodbye, Necronomicon. And goodbye, the King in Yellow. The King in Yellow is, uh, some Cthulhu shit, isn't it? I feel like it's some Cthulhu shit.
Hmm. Alright, exit to the right and re-entering. You can try and slip past the crab. Maybe we just have to be fast, fast about it. Alright, get ready, and we're gonna run through real fast. Yeah. Ah, damn it, he was in the way. Okay, now it doesn't like we can slip past the crab. Oh, maybe we just have to wait for him. We will let the crab move on its own. And then I am certain. We shall defeat him at his own game. No! No! Damn it. Come get me, bro. Oh, no, you're good, Snarky. <laughs> oh, here he comes. He's coming after us. Yeah, we ran through. Jerome. We got lavender. Well, at least now we'll smell good. Suck it, crab. I got past you. Victory is mine. What is this fountain? The fountain is pointless. All right, the end. I believe he wanted us to go to the end. All right, I've been thinking. If we were to believe that Deus is indeed influencing the royal family, we need to be extremely careful about our next move. Even if we're just gathering information on magic, we'll draw attention to ourselves if Deus learns our true purpose. We suggest we do then. Clearly, we first need to release the prince from Deus's influence by finding, defeating the responsible henchman. So we're going to invade the castle? Precisely. Of course, we still need to find a way in first. Through the windows! Through the walls! And? Hey, guys, why are you staring at me with creepy faces all of a sudden? Wait! You don't mean on my broom? Hold on, are you guys for real? The rest of us can't fly, and I somehow doubt that castle guards will fall for any of your flirtatious shenanigans. Well, so let's get that settled. We should get the show on the road. Faster is better, ain't it right? We only have one chance to do this safely and correctly. We best to make sure we're prepared, even if it costs us a day. Uh... Apparently there's something you can do with 30,000 gold here. That is a lot of money. Ah, the struggle is real. One person at a time. That's everyone. Daz and henchmen should be near the prince at this hour. Finding his chamber's top priority. Act with stealth, people. Stealth! Ah, crap, we're dead. I can't stealth for shit. Okay. Oh, crap. Run away. That was a close call. Now the gods are off our, off our tail. Let's try it again. What? Okay, so you can't even do it when they're on the screen. Okay. For it. Bye bye. Wait for it. Damn it. This part's tough. Wait for their off screen. Okay. Oh, bullshit. 
You were off the screen. Uh, okay. Wait for it. Okay. All right, maybe I don't go that way. Because he's not letting me pass. For it. Damn it. Okay, so they do have visual capability. Okay. All right, so even taking a single step, they can hear it. Jesus. How do I sneak by these guys? All right, we did it. Okay. Where are we? My net vision is any better than yours, I tell you. You there, state your business. You've quite some nerve sneaking to the room of the Crown Prince. For the time being, I think Puppet Prince is more suitable title, eh, Laird? Guards! Guards! Ah, oh, crap. We're in trouble. Ha 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 The soldiers are coming! The soldiers are coming! What are we going to do now? Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. What are we going to do? Bar the door shut! Does me or does that parakeet look awfully out of place? <laughs> Whoa! Holy crap! Parakeet turned into a Sailor Moon monster. Peggy turned to that. Can't trust cute little birdies anymore. My name is Jamir. I'm very pleased to make your acquaintance. I'd really love to get to know you better, but last of things just aren't meant to be. A shame. Had you been captured as planned, you could have enjoyed a long, exciting life as my playthings. Sorry, but it ends here. At the very least, enjoy your beating, my pretties. Oh, damn. She has a whole bunch of, like, demon ninja girls. Everyone gang up on her. Oh damn it, I thought we at least got through one of them. Crap. Alright. Y'all take care of Jameer, I'll take care of the knights. You gotta heal. You gotta heal. One down. There we go. Both down. We got this now.
Now heal crest, please. Oh no, no need. Yeah, we kicked ass. Look at that, 10,000 gold. We could easily get like another 20,000 off screen, most likely. <laughs> Whew, we got her all right. How's the prince? What, what have I been? Who are you? We are the crystal gems. Guards, wait, what? Hey, Master, are you safe? I'm fine. Those not important guards are Rusty's intruders. What? They won't give a damn about what criminals like us have to say. Let's just behave like good boys and girls and do nothing. This sucks. It's me. We gotta eat icky food. Expect the king of the chief statesman to carefully analyze the situation and figure out precisely what's going on. You're saying we'll be released when they realize the prince has returned to his true self? Yeah. Boo. What are you complaining about? Gotta go? Oh, I appreciate you stopping in, Snarky. We're about done here anyway, so once I get to a safe point, we'll be cutting it. But you have a good rest of the afternoon. Good, sir. So, like, what do we do now? Just calm down. They'll probably come knocking any sec. I don't think it's going to take them long to realize the prince's change in demeanor. Or they better hurry up. They may be staying here longer. My skin's going to get all dry, pasty, and gross. Oh, hello. You look fancy as shit. Are you an elf? I want you to escort these people to the throne room. Treat them with courtesy. To the throne room? My name is Loongrum. I serve the kingdom as court mage. His Majesty invites you to the throne room. He wishes to personally question you regarding your actions on this occasion. Yay! Clarth was right! I ask that you state your reason for infiltrating this castle under the cover of Nightfall in order to save the prince. But what craziness is... Silence, Laird! You know nothing. Your Majesty, if I may, at this time, powerful magic is of utmost importance to us. With your country being the world's authority on the subject, our presence here should be of no surprise. You need magic? What for? It stands as only vulnerability, as you might glean from what I have said. Our journey is to execute him. What? Truly? Suppose that settles it. I summoned you all to my throne room to determine if you are mere thieves who saved Laird by chance, or if, it, or if your purpose truly was to save him. The pure your intentions were pure. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. The is was manipulating my every move. Father, surely this is a lie. I do not speak in jest. My ability to mobilize forces to provide assistance for the oncoming war has been suppressed until now. Upon reflection, I have no doubts in my mind that was Deus' objective. Excuse me for asking, but there's a war breaking out? Well, haven't you heard any rumors during your journeys? Well, anyway, the time draws near for Midgard and Ali of Ars to clash with Deus' forces. Now that you mention, I remember some folks telling us something like that. I wish to make you a proposition. If and when you feel your quest for spells has been met to your satisfaction, would you consider lending your power to the war effort? Hell yeah! Now, with that, you'd like to know the monster you dispatched left some spoils behind. Here's one of them, which you'll find it of use. And. Wait, this is a grimoire, one I've been looking all over for. Is it of no use to you? Either way, I have no right to it. I was not the one to slay the monster, after all. It happened to be clutching this as well. A spear, it's called Gungnir. Oh, damn it! Legendary artifacts had to be forged during the final battle of the gods. Joined with the full authority of Alvinus that showed no restraint. Hell yeah, I saved the prince and now we're fucking royalty. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. Ugh. I've got some promising leads to the ring necessary to, to pact with the spirit of the moon Luna. Is in there. It's vital to our cause. Very well. I shall have it prepared at once. Name of name of your leader procured at the Adventurers Guild in the city at your earliest convenience. My research awaits your highness. I shall be returning to my chambers. Bye, Elfgown. Yeah, we got a garnet packed ring, Gugnir, and a copy of Seleno Fragments. Is it better than the book we identified? No, it's not! <laughs> That's funny. Although Gungnir sounds pretty cool. It's better at thrust. It's better at average, so we'll take that. Okay. Alright, let us go to the end. Heal. We will go save. I don't know my way out of this castle. Right. 
And then when we return to the stream on Thursday, what is today? Today is Tuesday, yes, okay. So Thursday. Thursday should be the next Tales Up stream. Uh, damn it, I did it again. Uh, sorry, King, Queen, how do I get out of here? Oh, here we go. This should be it. Hey, there we go. Uh, yeah, when we come back Thursday, we will grab the pass and we will go to the mines. In the meantime, off stream, I think I will do some gold farming so I can get that 30,000 gold. And I will try to go back to the first continent to grab any spells I may have missed. Because I have a feeling that we won't be in the past for, you know, much longer. The crab part was the best. That was so much fun. Like, just good charming writing like that is needed in all RPGs. Right, in the meantime, let us go see who we can raid and wish them a very good happy stream. Let us see. Hmm. Doesn't look like too many people are on, but Skulls is playing PSO2. And she has been very awesome trying to help me sell the VTuber model. We will go ahead and give her a quick raid. Once I can find the button. There's the button! I swear one day I will actually be good at this. Alright, everyone. See some of y'all tonight for Hollow Knight. And y'all wish... Skulls a good stream, and I will see y'all later. Bye!